October 21st Daily Video Bible Reading from the Net Bible Psalms chapters 149 and 150 from the Old Testament Praise the Lord, sing to the Lord a new song. Praise Him in the assembly of the godly. Let Israel rejoice in their Creator. Let the people of Zion delight in their King. Let them praise His name with dancing. Let them sing praises to Him to the accompaniment of the tambourine and harp. For the Lord takes delight in His people. He exalts the oppressed by delivering them. Let the godly rejoice because of their vindication. Let them shout for joy upon their beds. May they praise God while they hold a two-edged sword in their hand in order to take revenge on the nations and punish foreigners. They bind their kings in chains and their nobles in iron shackles and execute the judgment to which their enemies have been sentenced. All his loyal followers will be vindicated. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him in the sky which testifies to his strength. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him for his surpassing greatness. Praise him with the blast of the horn. Praise him with the lyre and the harp. Praise him with the tambourine and with dancing. Praise him with stringed instruments and the flute. Praise him with loud cymbals. Praise him with clanging cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God, I've been reading a lot of A.W. Tozer lately, and I, I know that he talks a lot about worshiping you. And, and what does that really look like? Sometimes we think it's just uh, getting really into the music at church uh, for our worship team. And he has a quote that says, We must never rest until everything inside us worships God. It's not about letting the music capture our hearts and carry us away and we get all excited about you. Worship to you is, is an obedient heart set. It, it's how we look at everything in everything that we do day to day. In our life it's it's how our life reflects you that's that's what our worship is it's not singing a, a bunch of songs even in this last psalm it's not a bunch of musical instruments it is how our heart is set uh, in obedience in trust in faith in you and how our actions in our lives reflect that especially when people aren't watching probably the most important so that everything about us reflects our worship of you, our praise of you, our thanks to you. I hope that I'm always very clear, especially when I'm being vocal to other people, that the only reason that I have all the things that I do and that I am overwhelmingly blessed is because of you. And, and God, I hope that I always remember to give you credit for that because everything in my life, including everything about me, happened because you chose a long time ago to create Janelle and create all these amazing things about her. Not saying that arrogantly, I just know you created me for special reasons in your kingdom, just like you created everybody who's listening right now for special things in your kingdom. All of us, as you've said, are masterpieces. And how in the world could we not turn around and worship and praise you in everything we do? Not just in church on Sunday, uh, singing, singing words that everybody else is singing. And sometimes they tug at our hearts and sometimes we just mouth the words. But we should worship you in everything we do with our whole heart, with our thoughts, with everything in our heart, with our actions, with how we treat other people, how we talk to other people. Um, the things that we do during our so-called downtime, what our entertainment looks like should should reflect our worship of you. Um, how we live, the car we drive, uh, even how we act at work, all of that should arise from a worship, a heart set that is about you, God. God, I ask you as we wrap up the Psalms today that you just set our heart right in obedience, in faith, in trusting you. And in sheer thankfulness of all that you've given us, 
knowing full well that we give all of our thanks and all of our praise and all of our honor to you. In your son's name I pray. Amen. <music>